What's up, family? All right, send your cigar here. You are wherever you are. Hopefully practicing social distancing, staying safe, staying hydrated. It is Monday. Time for the New York's GNS Virtual Hearth. Um, it is a brand new week and another chance to do great things. And I want to wish everybody a productive and profitable week. So fam, y'all know it's cold. It is really cold outside. And I tried to uh, get down to the job site for a little me time before the workflow. There is still snow on the benches in Father Fagan Park, so I wasn't able to sit outside there. But uh, in front of my building, everything was cleared away. So I sat down there, had a, a Avo Heritage Special Toro. But I said, a little too cold to do the virtual hurt. So came upstairs to the studio. So here I am at the job site, uh, control room three here at WNYC, where I work. And uh, we're going to do the virtual hearth. And uh, yeah, this is uh, this is my studio. This, there's my there's the board that I'll be working on tonight. Control room three. And uh, so let's get to it. All right. Shout out to the medical professionals, first responders, EMS workers, police and fire, postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country the mom and pop shop owners, the bodega shop owners, the laundromat owners, anyone who has been considered and deemed essential personnel. Thank you for what you've been doing during the pandemic. Thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety for the health and safety of all of us in this city, in this state, in and around this country. What you have been doing during the pandemic, it is so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough, but we do say thank you for everything you have been doing during this pandemic. And of course, family, I gotta remind you, please check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they're not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that, that there's somebody out there thinking about them. So please get in touch with them any way you can, whether it's through a phone call, text message, social media, video chat, Zoom, house party, Google Duo, FaceTime, Skype. Just do all you can to get in touch with them. And remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with the elders of their families and their family and friends who live alone. No one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. All right, fam? So please take the time. It don't cost you nothing. And find out how they're doing. See if they need anything. See if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem. So just go on and do it. Don't cost you nothing, all right? So please take care of that. So family, I, I do have one thing to tell you all, which is very important, which is, um, come to my attention over the past uh, day or so. For the foreseeable future, there will be no Wednesday night herf. There will be no original Friday night herf. There will be no Sunday herf in Harlem. We are very sorry, but uh, because of circumstances beyond our control, New York's GNS will not be able to do those three weekly events for the foreseeable future. When we're able to get back on track, we will let you know and everything will be on and popping. But for right now, there will be no Wednesday night herf. There will be no original Friday night herf and there will be no Sunday herf in Harlem. All right, we apologize, but this is something that can't be avoided. So please bear with us. We'll be back on track as soon as we can. All right, fam, all right. So listen, uh, I have to get to the business of setting up my studio for tonight's uh, programming that I'm responsible for. So I am gonna wrap this up for today and fam. Oh, you know, even when I'm working, like uh, Troy Palomalo always says, always working. You know, Senor has to do. 
the diet, Mountain Dew. All right, fam, so listen. Please, fam, please remember, check in on the Eldersley family. If it, as my glove busts, I got to put on another glove. Check in on the Eldersley family. Your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together we will get through this. And yes, we will get through this. All right. Also, family, I got to remind you, didn't do this earlier, but I'm going to do this right now. Support the mom and pop shops. All right. All those great people that own the cigar lounges and cigar shops, they need our support now more than ever. So please, if there is a mom and pop shop in your neighborhood, near your neighborhood, go check them out. Break open the piggy bank. All right, fellas, pull the wallet out, blow the dust off, pull out a couple of bucks. If it's a, a, a shop where you can come in, make your purchase, grab and go, or maybe a lounge where they have comfortable seating, where you can come in, make your purchase, grab a seat, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air, and maybe pair that fine tobacco product with a, your drink of choice, whether it be an adult beverage or a soft drink, and maybe even have a conversation with another brother and sister of the leaf. But the bottom line is, in order to do that, you got to make your way to that mom and pop shop. All right? Please make your way there. Spend a couple of bucks to keep their doors open and their cash registers ringing. All right? Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. Hashtag support black business. Hashtag support Latino business. Hashtag support Asian business. Hashtag support small business. All right, fam? So that is it. That is all I got. I am that man, Senor Cigar, enjoying coming to work. Not enjoying to find tobacco products. I already did that. But now, coming to do my job, press those buttons, ride those levels, and do what I do. And as always, I want to wish you long ashes and Better days. Everybody, enjoy the rest of your Monday. If you have plans to go out after work, please be safe. Please be careful. We are in the middle of something we've never experienced before. This COVID-19 has taken so many lives, and we don't want to lose any more of you good, good people. All right? So please, take care. Be smart how you go about your business, all right? Wherever you're going, whatever you're doing, take your time, be smart, be safe, all right? Stay hydrated. And at some point today, I do hope you'll be able to put some smoke in the air. I do hope to talk to you real, real soon. You know I love you like a fat kid loves cake. Be safe, stay hydrated. I will talk to you really, really soon. And don't forget this. Holla if you hear me. <laughs>